Nice. That's what I've been waiting for. That's what it's all about. No! Where are you at? Where are you at? Hey guys, welcome to my first ever channel update. In this video, I'm going to be going over a lot of the questions I see get posted around the channel. I'm going to go over general questions like where have I been, what's next for the channel, and where's Spider-Man? I want Spider-Man! So, let's start off with where was I all of 2023? Why weren't there any videos? Well, to put it as simply as I can, life outside of YouTube for me got really busy and really hectic. I tried to film as much as I could of my projects throughout last year, but I lacked time due to being busy and motivation to work on the videos due to being so tired from being busy. The good news is things are better now and I'm working on having a lot more done for this year. I just posted a fun little Daredevil video, which is part of my ongoing Marvel Universe. Definitely check it out if you haven't I had a lot of fun making it, and I'm pretty proud of how it turned out. Another question I'll get out of the way is, why did I change the channel name and logo? When I first started this channel with my early Spider-Man videos, I didn't know how to change my name on YouTube without affecting my Google account name, so I just ran with my own name. Now that I've figured it out and started to gain traction on this channel, I wanted more of a professional name that reflects the content on this channel better than just having my name. So that's why I changed it. Okay, so moving on to a couple questions I see a lot from you guys. How come there's a Batman trailer video but no full length Batman animation? Where's Spider-Man 2 Enter Electro? And when are these videos coming out? So as some of you who also make animation videos may know, stop motion animation specifically takes a lot of time. And for me personally, if I'm not happy with something, I usually do a full reshoot until what I have in my head is in the video. That's kind of what's happening with the Spider-Man 2 Enter Electro Episode 1 video right now and why it's taking so long. Some ideas I had for it got completely scrapped and redid and I might have to tweak a few more scenes to make it the best video I can. With that said, when's it coming out? For me, it's hard to pinpoint exactly when a video may be finished, but what I can say now and what I will do from now on post updates more frequently and estimate a time frame. For this one, I'm hoping to have it sometime in February, just a little while longer. If that date doesn't get met exactly, what I'll do is I'll post updates on its progress as well as snippets from it in the community tab and keep you guys in the loop on this project. And since you guys are really hyped for this one, I'd like to give you a short look at the video so far. Hope you guys enjoyed that little teaser. I'll put out a full trailer when the video is finished so you can look out for that and uh, updates on that on the channel. But now let's talk about Batman. So I'm sure a lot of you guys have seen the rest of the Batman trailer on my channel by now. I worked on that video with a good friend of mine and that video is actually a prelude to a full Batman stop motion series that we're working on together. Uh, this is my first collaborative project and it's been a blast. I'm, I'm really happy to have worked on this and I'm really excited for it. And I'm excited to tell you that uh, the first episode is very close to being finished. The first episode is titled Case of the Sinister Syndicate and it's sort of a murder mystery introduction to the character in our series, which is heavily inspired by Batman's first appearance in Detective Comics number 27. I'm aiming to get this one out by the end of January, uh, the beginning of February for you guys. That's the time frame that I'm kind of looking at right now. In the meantime, here's a little preview of the video for you guys.
Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed that preview. You can look out on the channel for that video soon. Uh, next up, I just wanted to briefly talk to you guys about some of the other videos I'm working on. So I did a poll recently and asked you guys if you'd like to see a video of my favorite Marvel Legends of 2023. You guys said yes, and I had a lot of fun doing one last year, so you can look out for that video soon. I'm going to start working on it in the next couple weeks. Another video I talked about in a community post uh, sometime last year is an updated collection video of uh, my Marvel figures. I will be working on that in the next couple weeks as well. And last but not least, once I put out the Batman and Enter Electro videos, I'll be starting production on the next episode of Maximum Carnage. So that will still be continuing. I will be putting out that uh, second part sometime after those videos and I'll most likely give a better update on that once the videos are out. So that's it for the updates, but before I go, I wanted to share a few stop motion creators who've really inspired me lately. First up, I'd like to give a shout out to PCSM Productions. These guys make really top tier animations and they tackle both Marvel and DC Comics with a really cool crossover fight videos. Definitely check out their channel and, and check out their videos. If you enjoy my videos, I'm pretty sure you'd really enjoy theirs, so be sure to check them out. Next up is Wind Whirler. I've been really inspired by his work lately. He has a lot of great Marvel videos on his channel, and he does other content as well, such as reviews, gameplay videos, and Bionicle videos, which is an awesome throwback for me. He recently put out a channel trailer, so you can look into everything that he does from that video. Next up is Red Mask Animation. He's been supporting me from really early on, and before creating my own content, I was actually really inspired by his stop motion videos of Batman. Uh, definitely check out his channel, he has some great animations, great reviews, and he even streamed some Ninja Turtles video game action recently. His videos are a great time, be sure to check him out. Next is Spider-Boy16. Spider-Boy has created his own Marvel Universe with his stop motion videos, and they're all super epic. Grab some popcorn and a drink, and be prepared to enter the epicness that is his stop motion universe. His videos have kept me entertained for hours, and I'm sure they'll do the same for you. Go check him out. Last but definitely not least is Data Link's Magnus. He's been one of my earliest supporters, and if you like G.I. Joe and Transformers, his channel's a real treat. I've been really inspired by his G.I. Joe animations, as well as his Marvel videos, which feel very cinematic, and his reviews always give good insights to the figures. Check him out if you haven't. Well, that's it for me. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like and share it with your friends. I hope I cleared up all your questions, and if I didn't, feel free to comment and I'll give my best answer. With that, I'll see you guys in the next video.